kept looking at a gastric band and I didn't want to put myself or my children through the risk of me having surgery and when I saw that you could have the same effects through hypnotherapy that's why I wanted to give it a go. I couldn't believe the peace that I felt and the calmness and things that um, I came to accept within myself during it. I've never experienced anything like it and although emotionally I felt I went through the ringer a little bit, it was so worth it because of what came on the other side of it. I didn't have a very good relationship with my mother. Um, which led to an emotional eating problem and this was something that I had tried to deal with earlier in my life and being at the age of 43 it's a long way into my life to try and get this sorted and I didn't expect anything like that to happen or come from it um, and was very surprised at how deep you dug to find that and was really, really pleasantly surprised that for the first time in years I was able to deal with it and it really has sorted the problem out. I started on the 18th of January and it's the 20th of April. So that's February, March, April. In three months I've just lost under three stone. If you really believe that you want to lose weight it is a really, really good solution. I don't actually understand why they don't offer it on the National Health Service to people. I think it is a brilliant way to encourage someone to lose weight. I haven't looked back and, you know, I've struggled with my weight all my life and finally, and this is not just something that's going to happen for five minutes, I feel like it's a change for life. I think Adam is a lovely guy, he puts you at your ease, he listens to you, he takes everything in, he doesn't judge or make any um, comparisons to other people, it's all about you, your needs, what you want, what you want to achieve and um, all I can say, fairly nice guy. It was January the 18th last year. And I won't forget that day is the day I feel like my life changed. I remember you saying to me, you'll go home tonight and you won't feel any different and you'll get up tomorrow morning and it will start. And it did. <laughs> and um, I haven't looked back. I haven't had any weak moments at all. The problem that I had was emotional eating and that needed to be dealt with. And you went to that part in my mind that dealt with it and helped me. It's not really about what I ate, it was about the reason why I ate and once that was dealt with then I was able to get on with my life and not use food as a crutch. 22 stone. And where are you now? I'm just under 16. So right. it's taken me to this point in my life to be able to start losing weight and 15 months later to be able to say this is where I am and I'm not lost two stone, put on two stone, that yo-yo thing backwards and forwards, backwards and forwards. I've climbed that mountain and I've kept on going and I've come out the other side and I just don't feel like I'm ever going to go back. And it's taken me to 45 years of age to do that. And that was literally because I hadn't dealt with the demons that were in my mind, you know.